Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil Village. Now, in the last episode, uh, we took out Fishboy, Monroe, uh, got loads of items and jewels. Oh, look, he's got one of those bloody things now. You, sir, are a strange one. You always seem to... Yeah, the Cadoos. You always seem to have something relevant to our last uh, adventure. So yeah, we took out Fishboy, got the frickin' Magnum, uh, which is badass. Took down another actual werewolf thing, which was fun. And here we are, we're going to explore the last bits of the village. I guess it's the last few bits of the village, we're gonna sell all of our stuff. And I said I was gonna make a coffee. Yes, well, you see, I did make a coffee. And let me get my timer back up so I can actually know how long uh, I've been recording for because, you know, Shadowplay doesn't have these simple, basic things built in. Um, but instead, I remembered I actually bought five beers last night. Five uh, interesting beers that I haven't actually tried before. So I drank two of them last night, but I have a Duval here, which is a Belgian strong blonde. Um, I do like strong blonde, <clears throat> so no more. Uh, it's 10%, so I think we'll start with that one. Anyway, let's go. Ah, oh, my apologies. Hmm. Please do take a look at my new stock. Uh, I will, actually. Uh, I shall absolutely have a look at your new stock. We have crystal skulls. We have crystal wings. We have the crystal bees. 20,000 ducats for that motherfucker. Jesus. Okay. Crystal Monroe, or Monroe, however you want to say his name. Necklace with one hole. Nah, single, uh, silver angel. Does that? You can flog that too. I want to check. This is Lord Moreau's? Yeah. I suppose it's what they call the beauty of the grotesque. Hmm. Apt. I like it. Yeah, let me just check that silver angel. Let me know if you find anything else of value. So no, we can't. Okay, very valuable. We can't actually Welcome, Ethan. Uh, do anything with it. Where do you get so much money, Duke? What is your secret? Mm -hmm. Right, gunsmithery. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. Yes, so... Not sure what we want to do with the Magnum yet, but let's have a little look in here before we make any dis- Oh. You don't have anything, dude. You have nothing. I will buy that. Uh -huh. I'll buy your handgun ammo. Just because it's cheap. I'll buy your shotgun shells. Why does it say like 15, but we can only buy 5? Alright. I understand that. But hey, it is what it is, I guess. <laughs> right, yeah, I know, buddy. Everything's a laugh when you're the one holding the purse strings. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I might upgrade... Oh, that goes up by 150 damage. But I... I, oh, I don't know. Do we feel limited by the damage that our weapons are dealing out? Uh, honestly, no. So, uh, I don't know. I mean, I know, like, if we get another rifle, for instance, I know, excuse me, we can sell these for a good amount of coin, but I don't know, guys. I, mean, I get the feeling that capacity is always good. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that starts doing a bit of damage, doesn't it? Uh, do you want to upgrade that? I mean, it's such a paltry amount of extra damage. I think I think we're not going to. I think we're going to roll with what we have for now. Okay. <clears throat> Till next we meet, indeed, quite. So, uh, oh. Six-winged. Um, can we go up there? Can we? I don't know. Actually, one thing I do want to do... Because we're closer. Let's have a little look at this. Because we needed the... Um, uh, what do you call it? 
the actual twizzy machine to do this, didn't we? The crank. Yes, that thing to do this. Uh, now, I think I've had this spoiled by, again, YouTube comments. Not on my videos, but just in YouTube in, in general. Um, the, the, the rare fish is down here somewhere. Uh, I don't know if my missus managed to get the, the rare fish. But I also... To the vineyard. And there's a treasure there. Where is, where are we actually going? What's, oh, that is the right... No, that's got to be the way to him. So I'm guessing this is like another uh, secret, I guess. Let's have a look anyway. Let's have a look. So I don't want to go the right way yet, because I'm sure there's lots of little bits and pieces to find. I'm hoping they're really going to open Resident Evil 4 Remake up. I want some nice little exploration pieces, and Resident Evil 4 would be perfect for it. Because it was uh, a little bit like this. You know, I mean, it, it wasn't exactly this, obviously, but this... Like, Resident Evil 4 gave you that feeling of exploration which this is totally taking the the torch and run with it um suspension bridge that's a pot of fields well i mean let's just get on the boat and see where it goes i'm guessing we can't actually get out of the boat here so this way and can we go down there I can't see why not. Well, we'll have a go. We'll just go both ways. Lel. Let's swing both ways here, me laddos. We've got a cave glistening with a nice eerie glow up ahead. I'm guessing that's treasure. It's got to be treasure, right? What else would it be? It's not going to be monsters. Monsters in a Resident Evil game, he says. <laughs> ah... Oh, right, yes, this, okay. Now, earlier on in the playthrough, I said about getting back here and uh, about how I was unsure how we would do that. This looks like how we get back here because there's a well here. This is where we first went after we left uh, uh, Dimitres's, I'm sure it's Dimitres or some shit like that, when we left her castle. And we definitely didn't break all of her windows, which is, you know, sad. Now. Ah, that's lovely. Don't mind if I do. You know, I still can't get over the fact that the promotional material for this game was all based around um, Lady D and her castle. And that was just a small part of the game. I still can't get over the how well they bamboozled us with that. And to keep something like that under wraps. Admittedly, I did do everything. Ah, it's a ladder. Okay. Uh... Well, I sure as fucking shit didn't expect a ladder. Okay, let's have a little poke our head down here. Have a little how's your father. I'm going to swig some more blonde beer. Ah, oh, yes. Don't drink and drive, kids. But drink and shoot monsters in the face, that's fine. Oh, lockpick. Oh, shit, yeah, we've already got a lockpick, haven't we? Whoa, dude, what's that? Ah, oh, landmine. What is all of this? Oh, I'll have to see if the missus found any of this stuff. I mean, she's pretty damn good at... Uh, look from the other side. Oh, there's a fucking treasure in there. Uh, she's pretty good at all of her exploration, so... 
I wouldn't be surprised, but I know she was freaked the fuck out by this game. Pipe bomb. So we've got pipe bombs. We've got... M Ooh. Oh, God. Here we go. Puzzles. <sighs> of course there are puzzles. Eh. Uh, right. Okay. Okay. Not bad. Right, yeah. We need that one as well. Okay. Oh, what the fuck was that? That was a glitch. Just got like force pushed off. The hell was that about? Right, okay. Okay, so how... Uh, this is going to be so that makes a complete path this way ah right and there's some shotgun shells over that Okay, I'm with you. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Can we push that off? Now, can we use that as a stepping stone? Uh, it doesn't look like it because... But we can use that one as a stepping stone, potentially. Oh, but we can't move that one. Uh, shit. So that's down. Can we? Uh, I guess we probably could pull that back, but there's no point. But you can obviously move this one here for a reason. Can we? Uh, can we push it back? We actually can't. Okay, so you know that's fine. Uh. So can we move this one again? No. So this one is just like a stepping stone. Got ya. I wish Ethan could jump. You know how many puzzles that would make so much easier if Ethan could just jump? Uh, right. Ah, wait, wait, stepping stones. Remember stepping stones. Can we shift this one up just a little bit? Let's have a look, because then we might be able to step up on them properly. Let's fiddle with that a minute. Uh... Uh, not really. Ah, or you know, we could just do that. Stop being such a retard. Can we say retard? Uh, I don't know. Uh, maybe I'm cancelled now. I don't know. I've said retard my whole life. Me and my mate were calling each other retards earlier. Um, yesterday actually. Right. So, ooh, that's gonna be for the. I don't know why I worry about what you can and can't say on YouTube, because let's be fair, you can't fucking say anything. Some cunt will cancel you for no reason. Right, um, combine. There we go. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Uh, is this going to be a case of, of, of bad news bears? Oh, 
Have we potentially missed stuff? We have missed stuff in here, haven't we? We definitely missed stuff in here. There's no doubt in my mind. Bugger. I didn't... Oh. Have we? Yes. Oh. Okay, maybe not. Cool. Right. Fine. All right. All right. Let's get out of here. All right. Nice little Brucey bonus. We'll have it. Oh. God, those Belgians, man. They and they know how to make some nice, uh, some nice beer. I tell you that. Okay. Now. Let's have a little peruse around here. I can't hear any any chattering wood. So I can't hear any of those uh, goats. Oh my god, look at it. It looks so cool. It looks so cool. It wasn't actually a very big castle, to be honest. It is big enough, don't get me wrong. Um, but it wasn't like Resident Evil 4's castle. Oh. Oh, hello. You uh <clears throat> you uh keep that gun tightly gripped there, Ethan. Oh no. No, I hate these fire puzzles. They suck. They're really bad. Oh god. Okay. Okay. Oh. All right. That actually worked quite easily. Now, are these like on a timer? Oh my god, look at all this cash. Well, I mean, it's not a huge amount of cash, but it's enough. Oh, yeah. Also, Chris, uh, I saw a comment from you, Chris. And I have been keeping out of the Discord. I have been. I just don't want any spoilers. But I have seen a, a comment that says, I missed it. I still missed a treasure in the castle. Um, which is a bugger. I can't think. Oh, hello. I can't think where I missed a treasure. But I will go for a 100% run of this game at some point. We'll unlock loads of power-ups and we'll go through um, and have a bit of fun with the game. Kind of like we did with Resident Evil 7. We had all the unlocks. Medium rare? What was that about? Setting him on fire? Okay. Yeah. Set fire to one in the story. Okay. Cool. Didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, come on, dude. Look, that's fine. As long as you're going to keep dropping me loot, you're welcome to keep, you know, turning up. But 25 bullets and shotgun shells. Can we can't go under here? Can we have a little? Oh, they're just going to keep coming, I guess. Yeah, I reckon they're going to just keep coming. And we're just going to keep knocking them dead. Because that is what we do. Yeah, I think you can tell that they're going to continuously spawn because they're not giving us any uh, money. Ah, do we have to set one on fire? Do we have to set one on fire and get them to wander over here? Let's try that. She on fire, she is. This way, my dear. Come on. Come on. Please don't burn to death. Okay. That was quite cool. So that achievement you're going to get regardless. Basically. Nothing. Nothing at all. Just extra crispy. Golden lady statue. We certainly have that. Magnum rounds. Magnum rounds are weird. You get them in like cases of one. And there's still... A... Oh no, the treasure's crossed out. Okay, cool. So we're done here then. Okay. A nice amount of dried chilies everywhere. 
Ooh. Okay, that was cool. I enjoyed that. Not quite as hard as I thought it was going to be. Any more of you bastards hiding inside? Nah, I didn't think so. Bitches. Right, okay, cool. Let's get out of here with a whole bag of loot. Man, I feel like Indiana Jones. Right, uh... So... There's our boat. Um, where's this fish? I could be wrong. Oh, didn't we actually find uh, something pertaining to this fish? Didn't we find something? Photo of a rare animal. Photo of a strange bird. <clears throat> no, I think I read about it somewhere. Okay, let's head back then. So I, th I think we've cleared this area out. I don't think we can get to the water anywhere around here. So let's try going behind us. I wonder what the rare fish would actually be. Would it be a shark? I don't know. Maybe it's an eel or something. But definitely, yeah, looks like we can indeed go this way. So, why the devil not? I really want that increased walking speed. I love to be able to... Oh, hello. I do like to be able to move quickly in games. So, where does this come out? Ah, this is the ceremony site. Okay. Right, let's have a little look around. So we have a cave. What's in the cave? Keep your eyes peeled, Ethan. We want to see any kind of glinty, flashy thing. Uh oh. There's going to be something big and nasty in here, isn't there? Yeah, you know it. There's something in here. Right. Let's go back outside. And let's fully explore outside and then come back in. Because I don't know, man. There's... Uh, that didn't work, did it? No, that did not work. All right, let's go back in. This gives me an excellent opportunity to drink some more beer. So that's fine. Okay. Right. I'm still surprised at the fact that Heisenberg is an enemy. I'm sure in some of the promotional material that I saw. And again, granted, I you know, I didn't I didn't look up much of it, but I thought they mentioned that he was like, "Ah, oh, right. We have fish." Okay. So this is where the fish is. I was wondering whether they were going to be in that cave some finest fish. All right, so the Special fish just looks like a normal fish. Okay. More fish. Cool. That's fine. And there looks like there's going to be something big and ugly down in that cave. Is that it? Is that everything? Not seeing a fish symbol on the map, which is concerning. Do you know what I like about Capcom games as well? Uh, especially these Resident Evil games. Is they just work as well. Have you noticed that? Like, you don't get really many bugs and glitches in these games. I mean, there's a, there's one or two. But to my knowledge, like, a Resident Evil game has never come out of the gate flat out broken. You know. I know we shouldn't be praising that because that's standard. It shouldn't be you know, praiseworthy thing. But when you look at what fucking dog shit these other um, companies far out of the, uh, you know, uh, do we do we have to talk about, uh, are we going to talk about fucking cyberpunk again? I still haven't been back and played any more of that. You know, I'm just over that game. Maybe when I get a new graphics card, I'll, I'll go back. But 
Oh, I just got such a bad taste in my mouth about that game. That game was terrible. Oh. Okay, maybe terrible is a bit unfair. It wasn't an antique coin. Maybe it wasn't terrible, but... You know. Is that a treasure? Oh my god. Yeah. We... Are we going to be up, able to upgrade our, our inventory like one last time? Because we've done it twice. I think in Resident Evil 4, we upgraded it, th I want to say, three times. So it could actually be more than that. I'm pretty sure, looking at this, we might be able to squeeze one more row. One more row in. Ooh. Tactical grip. What's that for? That That's for that. The W870. Where's the grip? Where's me grip? Where's me grip? There's me grip. Examine. Uh, greatly increases rate of fire. That's nice because you can't... What is the rate of fire standard? So the rate of fire is 1.6. And that takes the rate of fire to one four. Okay, it doesn't do too much, but you know anything's better than nothing, I guess. All right, let's get some more rounds. Now this looks like Chris and his buddies have been here. Data sequencing complete. Ninety-nine point nine five match to the Dolby Muta Mansi. Yeah, yeah, I can say that. The deviation of 0.05% can presumably be attributed to artificial changes by humans, which means this is probably the source. Further investigation into how the connections manage to find and extract the mold is needed. So these two are linked. It's funny that Ethan's involved in this again, isn't it? Mm, two different places, totally different places, uh, uh, you know, <laughs> from a geography kind of standpoint. Uh, the fungal colony is spread out under the entire village. Ah, when you take the Baker incident into account, the hosts of the Mutomyce are part of a network of consciousness. Okay, uh, if that network is linked to here, then could we assume this organism here is data storage? If that's the case, then what data is Miranda after? Ooh. Yeah, because when we got in, uh, fell into the mold as Ethan in seven. Oh, hello. Oh, hey guys. Yeah, when we fell into that mold pit, we, um, you know what we're going to do? We got to experience all of their consciousnesses and stuff, didn't we? But how comes these guys are becoming zombies and stuff? Whereas in 7, you just became a mold man. I mean, there's definitely something is quite different here. It's similar, but it's different. Oh, jeez. Oh, this has got to be like, that's got to be like mold, isn't it? These look like tree trunks and stuff, but it's not. Okay. Right, I mean, well, we have what we came for. Let's go back, see the Duke. And we have, like, over 100 bullets again. Which is good, because we haven't been in this position for a while. What about our shotgun? Yeah, we've got over 50 shells, too. Yeah, this game definitely, you know, doesn't fuck around when it gives you ammo. There's... Too much ammo, if anything. But that's fine. Do you really need to be down to your last few bullets and running away in a Resident Evil game? Have we ever had that in a Resident Evil game? Not really. I mean, on the harder difficulties, yes. But on the standard difficulties, no, we've never been like that. But then I say that in every, every time I play Resident Evil. 
you know, this whole idea of running around with one shotgun cartridge to your name uh, and, you know, no healing items, that isn't actually what Resident Evil is. I know it's fun to look back and think that's what the original Resident Evils were, but they really weren't. Uh, okay. And I think, you know, if we ask ourselves why they, you know, they didn't do that, is because that's not fun. Yeah, I always come back to, like, amnesia. Um, you know, uh, all you can do in amnesia is run away from the enemies. And honestly, I thought the amnesia games, I only played one of them. Or did I play two of them? I can't remember. Uh, but they're utter dog shit. I don't get it. It's garbage. They're not scary. They're just tedious. I guess the stories weren't terrible but I mean of course that's just my opinion if you like them then hats off to you but I just I don't get it I don't get it at all give me a game where I can fight back okay I mean I did enjoy uh, summer I think it was called that was a fun game but that was good for the story in the world building. Oh yes. Hello. But again, not being able to fight back. Like the enemies were the most annoying part. Ooh. That's Demetress's uh, necklace. Very valuable. You just made like another cool 80, 80 grand. You were part with this? No, no. I'm more than happy to purchase it. Then purchase away, my friend. Right, give me this. Give me the stuff. Give me the stuff. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Now to cook. Cook up, my friend, and let us eat. You kill it, we cook it. Here it is. Please join me. Yeah, that actually looks quite nice on the plate there. But. So movement speed has increased. I wouldn't mind having that again. Yeah, me too. Uh, so <laughs> protein rich for turning boys into bastions. Um, can we health greatly? We can do this. Greatly increases permanently. Okay. We've gathered all the ingredients. Nice. Now. now we feast. Apologies for the wait. Here's your share. Thank you very much, Duke. Let's dine. Very nice. Health has greatly increased permanently. I wouldn't mind having that again. Oh, we can do that as well. Can't quite afford that one. All right, let's do it. Carry on. Thank you. Now to cook. Damn, we're going to be fat and full by the end of today. Nice. So I don't think we need that much. That again. So we just need more fish. And we have everything else. Oh no, we need more. No, we just need more meat. Yeah, we need more actual meat, not poultry. Okay. Indeed. Very droll. Right, okay. Let's go. Oh, we're out of time. Wait for the next ingredients. Me too, buddy. Uh, hopefully, we will get those soon. <clears throat> right, well, we're going to drop a save there, and we're going to end the video here. Where does our time together go? Let's, let's see. So, I think... I think, to be honest... Is that gate disappeared now? So there's still something there, so we'll go back there. 
There's something there which is infuriating. And there's still something there as well. So we've got these two to check out. And then we can get the flock out. Oh, there's ram. There's rams there. Fuck this. Let's go for a longer video. All right, let's go hunt some rams. Let's go have, see if we can have our last dish. Oh, look, they've smashed the gate down. Good lads. Ah, there you are. Hello. Hey, friend. Yeah, I know, dude. Look, this hurts me as much as it hurts you, but I'm still kind of hungry. So, give me your ass. Oh, there's two of them. Eh, uh, we've got the guns. Ow. We've got the firepower. How much do we get? Two meat. Come on, dude. The show must indeed go on. Okay. Is that all of them? Ah, oh, that's all of them. But we still needed poultry, didn't we? I think so. Oh, that's disappointing. Um... Ah, oh, dude. Dude. Don't do this to me, dude. You know what? Let's just, let's just clear this out. We're here now. We're here. It's going to be famous last words, isn't it? Because something's going to happen and, you know. That's not where we want to be. We need to be in this water wheel. I don't mind doing the longer videos, you know, because you know when you're just enjoying, ah, enjoying the game. Oh, it's a lockpick. Well, just what we needed, eh? Right? Just what we needed. Another lockpick. Just throw it on the pile of lockpicks that we have. I'm glad these gates are finally down. Rose is waiting for you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Okay. I don't know what it is, uh, Mr. Heisenberg, but I don't think I believe you. I also don't think I trust you either. Uh, is there no more enemies spawning? Lock from the other side, really? Is that one really locked from the other side? Do we actually just not unlock that one door? It's annoying. Oh, come on. Let's try and link everything up if we can. Okay. I'm actually getting turned around. I'm not surprised I'm getting turned around. I haven't actually played this game. Like I said, I'm, we haven't really explored the village for... Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, we can't go down there, can we? Alright, alright. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's go save it. And we'll break it off. Because we are nearly on 40 odd minutes. And when we come back, we shall explore. Now, I'm sure it's a piece of poultry that we're missing. Shall I choose something for? You can do if you like, sir, but... Oh, we can do this. We can... That's it. So... Cook. So, there is actually more... Um, meat than you need. Interesting. Apologies for the wait. Here's your share. Cheers, mate. Think such a dish could be had in this winterbound frontier. Yeah. So goods is more important than anything. So I anything. guess we don't need the fish anymore. Unless we're gonna unlock something. Little and often fills the purse, as they say. Indeed. He sounds so depressed when you sell something that's of little I look value. Forward to seeing the fruits of your exploration. Mm, me too. Um, it's interesting. 
it appears that we don't actually get an achievement for getting all of the dishes, which is curious. Anyway, guys, this really is the end for now. So, till then, guys. Thanks for watching.